Hi everyone, it's me again. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm watching episode 34 of Attack of Titan. Uh, we left off in a pretty interesting part. Um, fortunately, uh, Aaron lost the fight against um, Rainier. He was captured. They also took Yermir. And on the preview, we see that Aaron finally wakes up. They went to a, a forest like uh, Hinger predicted. As you know, they need time to recuperate all the energy I guess they used to about transforming a titan. We saw that they cut off uh, Aaron's arms and it looks like they were, I guess they're gonna, well, Gilmer looks like it's gonna uh, try to prevent Aaron from transforming. And I wonder if we're gonna get more answers behind their actions because I'm pretty sure Aaron is not gonna go down without a fight, definitely. And I wonder um, where are they exactly heading to? And also the Beast Titan troubles me. I wonder if, um, no, I don't, I wonder if uh, Rainier and Beltot saw the Beast Titan. I mean, do they have an alliance with him? I don't know, something about him tells me that probably not. So I'm really, really curious to like what's going to happen in this episode. So honestly, enough of me talking, let's begin right away. Honestly, I'm very, very excited to see what's going to happen next. Okay, they're already heading towards that forest but well, how long is it gonna take take them to reach there are you serious you could barely move oh that's right please please tell me what happened in there no it might have answers you honestly have to go Yeah, there's something wrong with that village. So it's been bothering me ever since. Okay, please, please just have someone check out that village. Opening. All right. Okay, I remember he barely woke up. You can. I don't think you can. They did this on purpose, didn't they? I knew it. Yeah, I want to know too. Where is this exactly? Yeah. 
Yeah, it must have taken a, a lot of energy. Yeah. Yeah, they're not going to wait till midnight. Yeah, you need to get information out of them. Yeah, you're going to need time. What? So they're working for someone. But who are they working for? What? What is he talking about? Dude, what are you talking about? Are you serious? Yeah, what are you talking about? Okay, that was really, really weird. Did Marco see something?
Mm. So I guess he's feeling the guilt. Yeah, why are he pretending to be the... He's like the victim. Damn, that's right. That's right. Oh my god. I can't believe I forgot. You thought? Are you kidding me? Yeah, you guys are neither soldiers or warriors. Exactly. You guys are murderers. Exactly. Damn. Okay, I love Aaron. But I still want to know the reasons for behind them destroying the wall. Is he going to ask about the Beast Titan? Does he know? What? You don't know? Yeah, exactly. I remember. Do they know him? Yeah, who is he? My God, wait, Aaron. Yeah, that's true. Exactly. Why would I trust you? I don't trust you at all. Yeah. 
Don't plot to that manipulation, Ymir. Ymir. Yeah, but what does it mean, no future? I think the enemy is that beast titan. I mean, they were so afraid of him. Are you serious? You're gonna join them? Damn, Ymir. Oh, they're coming. Damn, this is gonna break Chris. Uh, I mean, sorry, uh, his story is hard. Ah, oh, come on, that was it. Damn it. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on. children wow this is just getting better and better i mean we are getting a little bit more answers especially on this episode yeah i was right about thinking like do do they have an some sort of alliance with the beast titan or is he the real enemy because i do remember the way they stare at the beast titan is like they were like why is he here i mean do they know him because they did look very afraid of him and also, where is exactly their hometown? I'm wondering, is it outside the walls? I'm really, really curious. And I'm so angry that Gimmer got manipulated by Rainer so easily. And and I guess she's going to join Rainer and Beltoth. And this is really going to break uh, poor Historia's heart. Like, really, really bad. Because, I mean, uh, Historia, I guess, got attached to her. And she even told her her real name. Man, I wonder how how that that's going to affect poor uh, Historia. And it looks like finally this cat's managed to um, reach the forest. It shouldn't be that long. And it looks like Rainier's going to try to stop them and kill as many of the cats so they could escape. And I love the fact that... Aaron literally told him, you guys aren't soldiers, you guys aren't warriors. No, they're murderers. And he's exactly right. But I still want to know, like, why? Why are they doing this? <sighs> I mean, I'm still very angry at uh, both of them because they, they killed many, many people. <sighs> I'm still trying to think, like, what is exactly going on? Uh, I love the fact that Han um, Hanje... Like, we need to check uh, Connie's hometown. And definitely, I think it has some kind of, some clue. I mean, I'm still thinking probably, uh, did the Beast Titan do something to transform the people into Titans? I mean, that's one speculation I have. But I think I could be wrong. I, I really, really hope so. So I'm really, really curious to see uh, what they're going to find. Because there's still so many questions. I mean, they're answering some little, little things. But man, I really need to see the next episode. <laughs> uh, hopefully, I'll do it uh, tomorrow. Uh, but anyways, thanks for watching. And I hope to see you for the next video. <laughs> Bye.